Hello and welcome to Farm Space. We're out here at Stay Rays. We're chatting to Brandon Lear. He's going to be the auctioneer for the upcoming auction on the 8th of July. Let's see what he has to say. Brandon, welcome to Farm Space. Thanks very much, Pierre. So just chat to us about what you do and your relationship with Stay Rays. Yeah, so I've been involved pretty much from the beginning um, with Stay Rays in terms of the auctions and so on. Uh, and it's been a very exciting journey to be part of that, uh, going through and seeing the genetics that Graham has invested in, mm. um, and 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 the growth really of this auction to where it is uh, today. It's it's been very exciting. So this morning you took a walk through the Herefords and the Brahmins and the Mazines. What are your initial thoughts uh, for the lots on auction? Well, I thought Pierre that um, th that the group of uh, Brahmins this year are as strong as they've been for pr pretty much the last ten years. They've been selecting. Uh, very strictly on, on certain traits and qualities within the, the Brahmin breed. I think they've got that right, they're getting it right, they're still building. Um, so very strong string and set of bulls there. Uh, s the same with the limousines, I thought were, were really, were really good. Um, the Herefords and F1 bulls that are on, always functional cattle that we put forward there. And yes, we have screens uh, strictly today. Mm. And uh, so what's going on auction, we believe will, won't let any farmer down in South Africa. And what is the, take us through the process on, on making sure your quality checks are there for, for the auctions. What, what do you guys go through um, before each auction? So in, in terms of classing the bulls today or, or, or checking on them, uh, firstly, I like to say to, to my sellers, you know, don't put anything on that you wouldn't be prepared to use yourself. So mm -hmm. that's the first criteria. So if anything just looks doubtful, we take it off. So what we would do is look for in terms of bulls, uh, the certain functional traits. I mean, if a bull can't walk, he can't serve. It doesn't matter mm -hmm. how good the bull is. So we look at the feet. The feet have to be uh, correct. Um, legs have to be good. The sheath angle has to be correct and the sheath's uh, length, etc. Mm -hmm. uh, the testes, yes, that's important, but we leave that to the vets. They, they yes. know more about that. Once we've got that in place, then we look at the masculinity of the bull, mm -hmm. the general uh, muscling of that particular animal and then score the bully either makes the sale or he doesn't in this case lucky today just about all of them did mm -hmm. and then we'll categorize them in terms of what we believe are top third middle third and and bottom third animals and uh, and, and that's so uh, each animal will go through individually and and have a look at them and class them accordingly perfect so we've got the auction on the 8th of July um, how can we find out more information is it online is it in person what's what are the options well, uh, you can you can go to the FLA website or Brandelier uh, Auctioneers website as well. Uh, Stabrays will also have their information. Mm -hmm. um, so the options are to bid online on the day a live stream option, which will be on the uh, FLA pl platform. Uh, we do make use of telephone bidders still. A lot of people like to, to phone in. And of course, to be here on the day, uh, just depends on the COVID restrictions on the day though, Pierre. You know, we uh, are looking like we might uh, get into some restrictions going forward. So we, uh, we're very observant and respect those conditions on the day. And um, But if people can't make it on the day, we welcome them at any time to give us a call, pop along, and we'll take them through the cattle. They can make their notes and bid online or on the phone uh, if they cannot make it on, on sale day. Perfect. Brandon, thank you so much and good luck. Thanks so much, Pierre. Thank you, man. So there you have it. That was Brandon Lears. And as you can see, there's quite a few quality checks that I have to go through to make sure that the best animals are up for offer. 8th of July, be sure to be there. Till next time, cheers.